Hello everyone, welcome to Average Android J. My name is Jason. Today I'm going to test out some video game um, on the Sony Xperia Z2 and see how well it performs. And uh, uh, the background is the Modern Combat 4. Uh, I'm just going to give you some quick playthrough and let you see how the good game footage is, how the phone does handle. This uh, the Z2 has the Snapdragon 801 clock at 2.3 gigahertz, 3 giga RAM, and Adreno 330, which uh, in turn it gives you supposed to give you really a good uh, performance. And uh, right now I have a 43% battery life, and so I'm going to see how well how much it does drop while I'm playing this game. And uh, I have the phone hooked out to, I can pause the little icon here, the Moga Pro, uh, no, it actually hooked onto this. It's definitely a nice thing uh, to get uh, if you are, you know, like to play video game, uh, some games on your phone, uh, more or less, uh, you know, a uh, person should look like this. I'm just going to do a really quick game through and let you think, I'll let you know how I, what I think about it. And, uh... I will play a little bit about this start a little bit of the mission, and so uh, I'll go through this. And the guy hold me down here. All right. Now graphics pretty nice for. Oh, oh, uh, get hit again. Uh hit this part because I, even though I'm actually using the Moga uh, Pro controller for the phone to play this game. I still have to use the use the on screen on screen sometimes. Not stopping punch. Graphics is not too bad for a mobile game. You know, it's not the best, of course. You know, compared to the PC game or console game. But you know that that being said, we are playing this game. Uh, uh, I don't know. Oh. Yeah, don't want to do that. Oh, don't want to do that either. Oh, oh, oh. I died right there. <laughs> I haven't played this game for a while now. I can't remember all the the all the control on this on, on this uh, controller. But you know, it's responsive, really, really smooth, no lag. The graphics just look really nice. Like I said again, no shit got here. Uh, Mobile Combat 4, I don't think it's free on the, on the Google Play or anything, but it is pretty nice game if you want, um, uh, looking at some, some game, I think it's like a dollar or something, I cannot remember, but, I mean, it does have auto lock feature in this game. Which is kind of nice because uh, it is pretty fast-paced game. Like I said, uh, okay, shot that guy. Oops, shoot. Oh, sprint away from the grenade. Uh, you know, the environment's pretty nice. It's pretty, uh, pretty nicely designed. Uh, and uh, no, the game run really smooth. Uh, definitely, uh, the Z2 de definitely handle uh, no problem. No, I have no idea when I'm really up. Move to that point. No, no lack at all, of course. Uh, okay, what I do now, clear lobby. Okay, I go in there. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, boy. Not really good at this game at all. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, keep dying on you. No, keep trying using the, the the controller and trying to touch the on screen. Uh, it's kind of hard. Uh, this game's not hard, not really, because you just have to uh, get a clear shot enemy or lock on to the enemy, just pull the trigger and then they basically die one shot. Uh, I, like I said, I'm a real PC gamer, but you know, if you really. Uh, you have nothing to do. Oh, shoot. Reloading here. Oh, there, shoot that. Oh, still reloading. Wow, that was bad. That's switching. Oh. Uh, I know, like I said, uh, the game does look nice. 
the phone handle no problem it's definitely not the most uh, CPU demand game that is out there uh, but you know there I don't think there are too many games out there that require you know uh, Snapdragon 801 uh, and uh, Adreno 330 but that being said uh, definitely nice still have a pretty heavy spec to play games like this uh, no no lack at all you can see you can see uh, and uh, one thing I do want to mention here actually I'm going to do this in a second I'm going to pause the game I am going to Oops, locked the screen by accident. I do have to say, uh, the bristle on the Sony Z2, a lot of people complain about it. It says a little too big. But, but honestly, when you are playing games that does not, this, this is not compatible with the controller, uh, it's a good distance. Uh, no, it holds nicely. If the phone are actually the screen actually out all the way to the edges, you know I'll, I'll be trying to touch I'll be I'll be trying to touch you know the, the control out here instead of in here which is more comfortable holding it. I'll show you. I turn I turn my uh, the controller off and uh, hopefully yeah. Oh, is this gonna be weird for me? Yeah, it's very weird. I haven't I haven't played this uh this game without controller. You know, it definitely more, it's more comfortable. Give you a little distance between uh, the palm rest on your phone to a uh, actual screen. Definitely a nice feeling. And uh, I'm gonna just get out of here. I'm gonna show you another game on this phone. And I don't think it's compatible. It's gonna kill that game right now. Now I've been playing this game uh, for I don't know how long. Oh, five five minutes now. You only use two percent of battery life, more or less. I'm going to you know, kick open the e, uh, the, real, the Real Racing 3, which is probably one of the most CPU hungry game there is. Uh, I'm not sure what's the most CPU hungry game, but this is one of the things I think I can find on the internet. If you do know one that's really, really uh, demand tons of CPU, GPU perf uh, performance, let me know in the comment below and I'll test out those games for you and let you see how well it does perform on a Z2 uh, okay, continue I'm um, playing this game <coughs> sorry guys uh, mm, to start I played this game maybe you know, a couple times uh, mm, let's see race here like I said I really don't play too much game on my phone I play it once in a while I'm really bored just sitting there uh, on the bed, why well, don't feel like playing game on a computer? Of course. Okay. All right, start this. No, definitely a really nice uh, graphic game. Uh, one of the best I have seen so far. Uh, this game handle, this phone handle, this game extremely well. No lag. Really smooth. You know. I'm not sure you can hear too well. Oops. It pauses real quick. Let me turn the volume on a little more so you can hear it. Oh, don't want to quit the race. Cancel. Resume. And I can hear it really well. And I'll definitely perform really well. What was it doing? Huh. I thought I was doing a race. I guess not. Um, not a clue what I was doing. Uh, let's get back to another race, I guess. Uh, continue. Uh, don't want to upgrade anything just yet. Later. Uh, like I said, Real Racing 3. I think it's free on a Google Play Store. And I'm not 100% sure on that. But anyway. Uh, I, I have not play this game enough to know what's going on uh, maybe do the cup use that card race you know this 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 phone handling uh, a lot of race uh, a lot of game really well and uh, no problem uh, you're not be disappointed if you do get this phone uh, to get this phone just f mainly for uh, gaming uh, it has does support the 
PS uh, PSN. And uh, I mean, I play since three myself, but I don't really play that much anymore on the console. Peace game it myself here now. You know, Diablo three. Uh, looking to look at the Dark Soul two, but that's just been so busy lately. So you know, I can see. I'm trying to keep you in the camera still. Uh, handling really well. The graphics is definitely really nice on this phone. I mean, on this game. Uh, I'm not really a racing game person myself. Uh, just basically download this game, just kind of try it out for you guys. Hmm. This game does have a lot of different uh, control setting. You know, you can. Oh, you can actually uh, change different uh, way handle. This game basically uh, accelerate. I, the way I set it up now, I accelerate the car itself, and I tap the screen. You just for brake. Yeah, I tell the phone for uh, you know steering well. I'm doing too bad in third place right now. I'm gonna keep having the. Oops, that's not good. I mean, you guys have a rear view mirror, it's pretty cool. Pretty realistic, I say, you know, rear view mirror, side mirror. Go, as you can see on the video. This, this phone does kindle the game really well, like I said again. Um, definitely not gonna let it disappoint it. And uh, the 5.2 inch uh, display, um, you know, it's amazing. Uh, no, I have no complaint about it. I can see a lot of content. It's not too small to see anything. I come the race in third place. I think yeah, third place. That's okay. I don't want to keep. Uh, but anyway, and so uh, continue. The phone does get a little hot. No, right around this area. That's probably where the CPUs are. I'm assuming it gets kind of kind of hot. Uh, I mean, we haven't played game that uh, that long. This video is about only 12 minutes so far, so uh, the phone does get hot. How hot does it will get? I'm not 100 sure. And uh, we are at 39 percent right now. That's about 7 percent drop in um, 12 per 12 minutes of uh, play time. So you know that does, that will give you pretty good uh, play time. Let's just calculate this out real quick. It's uh, seven percent in twelve minutes, roughly, and if you times hundred percent, if you will play the phone completely charged to die, it's probably give you an hour of play time. But I mean, who? I mean, I don't know that many people actually sit there, uh, play an hour, an hour of uh, games on feet on the phone, on a mobile phone. But anyway, uh, this is. This is the uh, quick review video, uh, a quick vi a review video of the Z2 on how handle the how handle the games, and uh, on all it's quick quick uh, quick um, summary. It's handle the game really well, smooth. I don't think there are many ga games out there that will make this phone lag. I don't think there is any at all. You know, has a beautiful 5.2 inch display. You know, it definitely won't have problem. Uh, Scene and content, nothing will be too small on this display. You know, really, really nice handling, uh, nice uh, layout for your phone. You no, know, it give you a little distance from your palm, edge of the phone to the control, right, edge right around this corner. You know, so uh, this phone definitely will not disappoint you uh, when you play video game. The phone does get hot, get kind of hot. Uh, only play for like 12 minutes, 12, 13 minutes, and it's already kind of hot. So uh, I can foresee this phone if you play for 20, 30 minutes with a game that d demands uh, more or less process power, you will probably get you know relatively hot that you might have to stop playing. But other than that, um, this phone handles any video games out there pretty well. Very powerful phone, and uh, you will not get it, you will definitely not get disappointed. So uh, if you like this video, please thumbs up, uh, please subscribe if you want to support me. And if you want me to do any kind of, uh, any kind of uh, <clears throat> review, uh, please let me know in the comment below. I will try and get to it as fast as I can. Like I said, I've been kind of busy lately. 
But anyway, thanks for watching. See you guys later.